Oh, 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 oh. Captain Marvel. Yeah. I got goosebumps. I mean, I thought it was a really, really good trailer. We have no idea what threats are out there. We can't do this alone. We need you. The thing that made it sort of um, even better was this sense that um, because the Marvel Cinematic Universe is sort of coming to an end next year with the Avengers 4 movie and I, it felt like the new direction or the new, let's say the next decade of Marvel movies, it sort of felt like it's gonna be it has had this sort of a feel of something new and fresh and sort of like uh, it made me excited about the next phase of yeah. Marvel movies. Yeah. Yeah, they're obviously exploiting on the throwback thing with the yeah. 80s with the blockbuster video <laughs> in the beginning and, 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 and Nick Fury with hair. No. Yeah. I don't know if this movie will tell how he lost his eye. Uh, it might be. It could be, yeah. Um, I had the main thing that I'll remember about this trailer is is fans complaining about Brie Larson only have, having one expression. Oh and yeah, she, the smile gate. Yeah. yeah. Oh god. Uh, and the uh, and I don't. I think Brie Larson is. You know, I think she's an okay actress. Mm. I don't. I'm not a. I'm not a huge fan yet. Mm. I'm hoping that this movie will change my perspective. Um, in terms of just if if the um, if the Lisbeth Salander films trailer mm. gave away a lot of plot points, yeah. this was the opposite. This didn't True. really. This was just scenes after another, which weren't mm. really connected, and just sort of cool things happening. Yeah, which might be a good thing. Mm. I mean, in a trailer, it's good because it's not giving away too much, but it's it can also. It can also sort of mean that that the story isn't that coherent, <laughs> um, unfortunately. Um, in terms of in terms of expectations for the Captain Marvel, I'm not a huge fan of the of the character itself, but I really like that they they've sort of found a way to continue the whole thing. Mm. Uh, I, I think that it's good. Yeah, and I mean if. Marvel does have this, after all the movies that they've made, I mean, none of them are bad. Some of them are just okay, but I mean, they've, and they've gotten just better at making these movies. Yeah. So I think it, uh, there's this, I have this sense of trusting the brand, yeah. that they know what they're doing with their characters. The only problem here is that it didn't seem to be a barrel of laughs. No. And and Captain Marvel is sort of kind of sort of Superman kind of character, mm. so it's hard to it's harder to make that kind of character interesting. That is true, and that that is also I think you know if uh, if uh, I am not looking at this movie as uh, as like a, as a source of enjoyment, I can look at it as a source of how are they going to make this thing work. Yeah, and that is always interesting. To yeah, see. yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't enjoy movies anymore either. <laughs> <laughs> For a year, now. <laughs> can't remember the last time I enjoyed a movie. <laughs> it's a good day, I think. <laughs>